Hi everyone and welcome to our Pit Science YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to talk about some of the numbers functions in JavaScript. These functions allows you to work with numbers in varieties of ways, such as finding the maximum and minimum value, rounding numbers and converting them to exponential notation. If you're new to the JavaScript or if you are just looking for a refresher, I hope this video will be helpful. So without further ado, let's get started. With number, there are few more uh, functions such like finite, which is between the max value and min value. Okay. There are some min value in the JavaScript. So let's see what are the min value. We know that min save and max save has large number of, but beyond that also we can calculate those. But after that, it will change to exponential value. In the output, you will see min save integer and max save integer as digit of number. But min is negative and max is positive. It both have 16 digit number. This is nothing but which is equivalent to mathematical, mathematical notation 2 to the power 53 minus 1. And in min and max value, you will see 1.7 a large number with exponential to 308. One is negative, another is positive value. This is nothing but 2 to the power 1024 times minus 1. So this says that we have some limitation with our number. Namaste. Welcome to Pet Science. We'll create a function. So let's say I'm passing x as a value is finite. This will check is it finite number or not. If not, then I, I will say number is not finite value. So if I console this, I will get the same. Way. What if, if I give a max value? Yeah, because this is actually representable. Beyond that, you cannot. So what if, if I just add one more value? So let's uh, multiply by two. So number is not finite value. So beyond that, you can, uh, you cannot get the value. So how to represent the exponential notation? See this example. So what I'm trying to do is 1, 2, 3, 4 exponential to what is the number. So this is a number within that term. I'm just adding a function called 2 exponential. I am not given any value. Another, it has some finite number. Okay. So if I add it, happen in this case, it has not changed anything. But if you see at the last 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 is omitted. We cannot see 4. Why? See, it's nothing but it's rounding off. So, 4, 5 means the 4, 5, uh, it will just extend to next value, which is 5. That's the same uh, rounding figure, how we can do round figure in JavaScript. So, we let's see this example. Same number, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, point to fixed. So, what I'm trying to do is, this means here, to add that fraction to how many digit uh, it should take up. So in this case, that was exponential behavior. For this one, I am extending the fractional part up to two. So let's see this uh, example. This example, local string. If I run this example, I will have get Indian currency value. Right. If you want to represent a number to the local means the local uh, country string, you just have to add to local and the uh, string of that. So EN means English, IN is India, the US would be USA and there are many just like that. So we, we use different, different uh, units, tens, thousand, uh, one lakh. In uh, USA, they say million, right? There are difference of currency. So because of that, we use this different uh, currency statement. Okay. So see the example, it is one, two, up to, see, this is up to 10 digit. Then we have one, two, nine digit. Okay. It is 19, 19 uh, digit number. So what if, if I try to show that in string? So first of all, this is evaluate. So JavaScript internally also check, evaluate that figure so that it should not fall beyond that 17 digit number. So if you just reduce this number, you probably will get after 17, it has round off to next value. What is precision? 
to add the to add the precision uh, number. So if you see this example, if I want to add five, it will change the patient number. Okay. So let execute this one. Very simple example. So twelve point two, it will change. Uh, it will take only five precision number. So one, two, three, four, five. Up to five, I should be able to uh, view it. So it is displaying plus it will also rounding off. So every time whenever there's number function, it will be round off. That's all for this video. I hope you learned a little bit about JavaScript. If you have any questions, please leave a comment below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.